Good evening, guys. Detective Dash here speaking. So, where are we right now? So, obviously, about a week ago, they tried to kill former president Donald Trump. So, in the time like now where all these conspiracies are coming to light, the attempted assassination on this former president is an example of that specifically. The attempted at assassination on former President Donald Trump is the perfect example for these conspiracies coming to light. There's so much videos out about Thomas Matthew Crooks, so much conspiracies being passed around about the Trump rally shooting that there's no way I can come on this video to get into specific details involving the Trump rally shooting. There's absolutely no way, people. So... You see, I knew that there was something happening. Like, over the last couple of years, I explained that, you know, all the target individuals, all the alien abductees, all the highly spiritual people and chosen ones, it's pretty obvious that something has been going on over the last couple of years, and everyone don't know that. Being that, I already know all these things. When I heard people talk about, you know, politics, first of all, I know that politics is a distraction. You know what I mean? So let's not even much put politics and conspiracy together until this happened. And I, bro, if it wasn't for this shooting, if it wasn't for this attempted assassination on former President Donald Trump, I would not see, bro, I would not see that there's so much conspiracy involved in politics, bro. The Illuminati being involved in politics and stuff like that. So, one can only imagine that there'll be conspiracies, you know, like the Illuminati involved in you know, politicians. I mean, they're corrupt people. They don't care about their country that they supposedly be trying to work and make a better place. They don't really, they don't care about the country. So it makes you, it makes you wonder, why are you actually doing this job? You know what I mean? It's for the greed of money. And obviously, you know, that greed of money, you know, most likely involves the Illuminati. So let's pause. Let's pause the Illuminati and politics right there. You guys know what I mean? So, Biden drops out the race, right? This is the perfect, this is perfect proof or the perfect thing to make what I'm about to say even more believable right now, bro. Biden drops out of the race. And they said that Biden drops out of the race because he caught COVID-19 for, I think, the third time. It's like, what, his third time catching the coronavirus? It was already being said that a lot of people were trying to get Biden to drop out of the presidential election. But you guys had to lie and say that he had COVID-19. And all of a sudden, that's when he drops out, right? So that means that now is telling us that you guys was lying about a whole bunch of other things during this pandemic, tricking the people, not tricking me, not tricking the highly spiritual, not tricking the woke and the smart, but tricking all these people that don't know about what goes on behind closed doors. These people blatantly, boldly lied to the people of America and said that the president of the United States of America caught COVID-19 and that's why he dropped out the race. That's not true. So to make this even more believable, you're trying to tell me that the president of the United States of America caught COVID-19 around the same time where everyone was talking about him dropping out around the time in Biden, around the time when everyone is talking about Biden dropping out. Around the time when everybody's talking about him dropping out of the race. That's when he catches COVID-19.
that also brings another conspiracy up. Bro, there's so much viewers. There's so much people. Remember, politics, that's what everybody's paying attention to. So that means that you guys lied, but they didn't even much care about how much people could possibly find out this lie because they simply don't care. They don't care anymore. Once, bro, once, they'll try to make things more believable, bro. There's no way how they can possibly think that they could put that lie out and there wouldn't be people that, that knew that they were lying, bro. They, because, bro, they're not idiots. They see that the world is waking up. Yet they're still putting out these lies like what they did. So that's proof that these people simply don't care. There's no way these people care if they're boldly lying like this to America, bro. They said that the president of the United States of America caught COVID-19, bro. I'm going to say it again. Guys, I'm going to say it again. This is proof that these people time is coming to an end. So they're getting more blatant. They're getting more bold with what they're doing. They're not things that they once did hidden. Things that things that they once did behind closed doors in the dark. They're doing it in plain sight. Plain sight. No more hiding. The Great Awakening is already here. There's already thousands, perhaps millions of people that woke up just because of the coronavirus pandemic. Not to mention all these other things that's happening. So now it's like they're desperate, bro. They do not care.